Welcome back to my kitchen. If you are new here, my name is Christine. Today we are making a yummy chopped chicken salad recipe. Come with me, let's get started. If you have seen any of my videos, I have done this teriyaki marinade. I got it from Acre Homestead so many times, but I'm going to do it again because that is the start to this recipe. I'm going to put it in here. Let me show you how I do it. So for the chicken marinade, we just need a half a cup of soy sauce, a half cup of oil, half cup brown sugar, garlic, fresh grated ginger, or you could use dried. I don't even peel it, as you can see. I just keep it in my freezer, grate it when I need it like this, and in it goes for marinades. Korean red chili powder, one of my very favorite products. I love this, it's got great flavor. It's not super spicy, it's more of a warm, sweet heat. It's absolutely divine. I can link it down below. About a tablespoon or so. And last, some sesame oil, about the same amount. And that is it. This is by far my favorite marinade. I make tons of it all year long, but particularly in the summer, I'll just line a bunch of my bag holders up and prepare a bunch of these to pop in the freezer. And that way you have dinner at the ready to throw on the grill over the summer. So I'm just going to get this nicely Combined, get all the ingredients mixed together. And I'm going to pop this in the refrigerator for probably about four or five hours. Then we will throw this on the grill and chop it up and put together our chopped chicken salad. It is going to be so delicious. We'll be back. It is many hours later. I grilled up the chicken. I have a bunch of celery and onion that I chopped up, as well as red and green bell pepper. And we will be chopping all of the chicken up, folding it all together, and making a lovely chopped chicken salad. And you could cut this up as finely or as coarsely as you'd like, depending on what kind of chicken salad you are looking for. We had a downpouring of snow today and now the sun is just shining so brightly on me. So hopefully you can see this okay. It's still really, really cold here in Michigan. I am not going to season this with anything because this chicken is so well seasoned and so flavorful. Trust me, it doesn't need anything else as far as seasonings go. Next time going in with my Japanese mayo, I may have to get another bottle out. Next, I'm adding in all the celery and onions. And the red and green bell pepper. Just going to fold that all in. More Japanese mayo. A fennel mix. Okay, I have a tortilla wrap. 
I drizzled a little bit more Japanese mayo, of course. I added in some cucumbers. Let's give this a try. Let's see what we think. Mm. Oh my God, that is amazing. I'm just getting out some grapes, which are like the size of globes because I really like to eat this with grapes for some reason or apples or some kind of like sweet fruit. This is to die for. I also have some tomatoes sliced up with salt and pepper. That also goes great with this chicken salad. There's just so many things you can do with this. You could eat it by itself if you have gluten-free, low-carb family members. I made a bunch of it as you can see so I'm going to have this for lunches um, to pack for my family members for the days ahead and we will eat all of this. It is so, so good. Give this one a try. You guys are going to love this. You could use this as a dinner recipe for lunches, super versatile. I just want to say thanks for joining me in my kitchen today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really, really helps me and my channel. Subscribe if you want to see more of my content. I upload every other day and I can't wait to see you next time.